Hey guys, Captain Stretch here from the live stream. And today I'm playing Babysitter Bloodbath. And also, if you see me look looking uh, down, I've got my I've got the live chat up. Okay, so what I'm. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna say is that this game was made by Puppet Combo, this which I have played his games in the past. And this is one of his very earliest games. Just waiting to see if it on how many people we can get. Okay, about to start in three, two, one. So here we go. Hi sir, I was so glad you could come on such short notice. Let me take your coat. Hi sir, I was so glad you could come on such short notice. Billy's really excited to see you. Like that kid in the background. No problem Mrs. Mrs. Johnson. Before we go, do you have any questions? How can I reach you? Okay, can I get paid now? <laughs> can I get paid now? Sure. We'll we'll be back in eleven. Um, how can I reach you? You might want to write down this number. Five 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 seven eight nine eight. Anything else? What time? What time should we put Billy to bed? Don't worry about that. He picks his own bedtime. Very good parents. Also, feel free to do whatever he says. We must be going. Talk, talk when we get back. Also, can you oil oil your door? Also, this is not how the game was originally played when it was released. It was played in. It was played like this. To be cinematic. But just for the sake of um, being able to play it, we'll put it on DVD mode and third. Again, there was Billy at. I want to watch TV. And um, if you've seen my live streams in the past, where I, where I've played Papa Combo games, um, you can tell right away that this is very early when it came to his works. So here we've got a first aid kit. 
Will you take the first aid kit? Sure. Also, we can strafe with QE. So, the TV. Turn on TV. The power button appears to be broken. Also, this game was originally going to be um, Halloween the game. Well, sorry, Halloween 3D. But on the Maker Puppet Combo ran into um like copyright issues with the copyright holders um so um he was forced to change I don't think any shot yet so he was forced to change the name to He was forced to change the name to something original. Take the remote. Also, Billy's got a huge room for just a kid. With, with his very own walking wardrobe. Here we've got a pocket flashlight, which will ma which makes it easier to see. A liquor cabinet. It's locked. Probably, probably the best, considering they've got kids around. Wait, hold on, what did I grab? VHS tape. A turntable. Too bad they only have ordered Coleman LPs here. Goes to the bedroom, open the door, locks. Rusted laundry had to open it. No, not right now. Don't need to do any laundry. Wait, was that a phone up there? No, oh, that was a painting. Wait, right, so what's around this house? A painting of someone who I'm not sure who it is. So, a um, packet of cigarettes on the table. It's too dark to see anything outside. Now let's get, get this TV on, so Billy has something to do. TV's on. I'm gonna... Let me answer this phone quick. Sarah, hello? Don't lie, don't lie. The game is a... The demons trail my legs to hell for you sit in your ivory tower. Hello? Hello? Hey Sarah, Jill? You scared the shit out of me. Huh? Will you phone my mumbling bullshit? Phone mumbling? When you just called. Are you off your meds again? I didn't call. If it wasn't you, then who? Hey, remember that guy from the mall? Are you gonna call him? Yes. 
You slut, what are you, what are you gonna say? I, I, I don't know, I wrote down his number, but left it in my coat. You, you, you better get and call me after you talk to him. Remember, my number is 555-8345. So that we'll get that back. We're gonna have to come and get it. Fine, I'll give it back. Examine. Five 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 nine one two four. Whoops. Hello. Hey Jack, it's Sarah from the mall. Oh hey Sarah. Are you doing anything fun tonight? Drinking, smashing mailboxes, and tipping cows. Cool. Oh yeah, I'm actually a looker. We can hang out if you have some. I, f I think I could get some. Come over at 11.30. Sure, bye. Okay, now I've talked to him, let's talk to S um, Jill. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, I keep pressing the wrong number. Nobody picked up. So what? No one's doing. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, we'll keep heads up. Okay, Captain. Yeah, we'll pick up the key. So where's the key? Oh, we'll, we'll get to you if you cook or something. You bastard. You want to get rid of Billy? Also, why does Billy have to lick a cabinet key? Like every night, does he just drink out of it? It's a kitchen. So your syrup. Yeah. We okay, take the milk. Box. Some milk. Made cereal and somehow got sh and somehow got strawberries in the cereal. Open the liquor cabinet, yes. Will you take the bottle of liquor? Now he's in bed, we can... Oh, I'm coming, hold up. Unlock the door. Hey, now nah, I don't feel like unlocking it. <laughs> Unlock the door. Yes. Now nah, I ain't feeling after this. I'm heading back inside. Nah, nah joking. Let's f okay. Let's f try and find Jack. See if he's out here. Ooh. 
You're an asshole. <laughs> you, you should see the look on your face. I'm not tagging you. Hey, come on, light up. It's Friday night. Also, uh, this room is if we need a save. What was that? And um, this room leads to the basement. I heard somebody out there, Ben Kid Jack. I heard a noise in the backyard. So, look. So check it out. All the songs out there. They beat them up. Go watch the movie. Go look at it now. You going? I, I don't know about this. Let's go check. I don't want to. Please. Okay. Let me go to this place. You can't see. Anyway, while he's doing that, let's call the police. You've reached the, you have reached the Washington Emergency Call Center. All of our operators are currently b busy. Yeah. Please come and call back later. Okay, well, so we're fucked. The police aren't available. Okay, I go up out operator. Washington. Washington Telecom, how can I help you? Operator, give me the police. Please hold. You've reached Washington call center over. Yep, they're busy. So we're screwed. Better wait for Jack to get back. Also, also, how many times has that happened where someone's called the police, like, in real life, and they're busy? Because I'm genuinely curious on how, like, often that's happened. <coughs> Shit. What happened to her lights? Seems like they went out. Guess I have no choice. Open the door. Take the axe. Yep. So let's see what's around here somewhere. Go up a fence. Get off the wall. A, a car. Gas up the car. Don't have any gas on me. So this is a a very big car. Open it. It's padlocked. Wait, was that Jack? Yep, there he is. Oh my god! Oh my god. Let me take the screwdriver. Yeah, we need to get. Back. Billy, I need you 
run and find someone to hide. Why? You see that? Do it! Just do it! As if the lights were going out wasn't enough to scare you. This is just made ten times worse. Because, like, I could walk around that corner there, and he's and he'll pro pro probably be waiting for me. I'm going upstairs. So what he's supposed to do is get to the rusted laundry hat hatch open it. But first let's explore this house at night. Because if you notice over here, you go inside. There's um, not many YouTubers will actually go over here, but you can See the window's broken. And there is no music, well, barely. What's on here? Can of beer. Bowl cutters. Yep. A chair. These chairs are nicer than the ones upstairs. I can't read at a time like this. Yeah, sure you can. Got a, a VHS tape. That reminds me, I I haven't saved. Oh, I should have saved. Those are previous saves. Guess we have no choice, I have to start again. But this time, speed running it to the point where we got up to. Running only up to the point where we got up to. He's running to the side of everyone, Mr. Johnson. Any questions for us? How can I reach you? Your number 555 7898. Anything else? So, what time should I put Billy to bed? Because it's own bedtime. Okay, so seven, eight, nine, eight. So we've got to keep that in mind for when um the uh, the killer comes by. Hello. Don't lie, don't lie. The game is a the demons drill my legs to hell for you sit in your ivory tower. Hello? Hello? Hey, sir. 
Jill. Just get the shit out of me. Yeah, 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 we've seen all this before. So before we get the um look at Kevin Key, let's have a look at where the killer came out of. So he was in this bathroom. Which means he was just waiting here like before be being surprised. Look at Kevin. The chest tape. Kind of Billy's room. No, well, the parents' room, I assume. Extra windows. Different bedroom. Take a pocket. Yep. Yeah. Center. Please come back later. Upper operator. Yep, still useless. So without the lights, you can still see, but it's hard. 
guess I have the choice. Open the door. Actually, what if I opened the door early? Like, if I open, open the door early, does that mean I just have to run to the door? Fine, Jack. I'm gonna save. Okay, we're in the safe room. But, but the music doesn't sound like it. Hold on, let me just fix the music real quick. We saw the phone numbers. I got a um Okay, oh, got a comment. Um, how, how's it going? Yeah, it's going good, actually. Let me just uh, let, let me just go in here for those questions. Yeah, so okay, so the question is, how's it going? And um, it's going going good. But I'm a bit into the um action. And so, so, so. So like, we, so do you want me to restart the game while I, so you can see what's going on, or, or do you just want me to continue here? Because this is just after stuff has gone down. Anyway, do not. Um, okay, so now you know not to go through that door unless we want to get killed. Just take the ball, please. That is an old radio. Some exercise equipment by. 
fitness master. Also, I don't trust picking up that ammo because I've been killed so <laughs> Who haven't seen the live stream from the beginning? This is what the camp, the game's supposed to be played in. But anyway, so third, I love the door. Actually, now nah, I feel like staying in the basement. Okay, so okay, what have we got? So I've got VHS tapes, some ammo, and a. Some bolt cutters. Oh, I didn't get something from the basement. I have to go back down there. It's so silent. Watch almost any YouTube and they'll make comments on how the game is so scary. <laughs> safe room like we can do he never comes in here and while we're here I just, well, I just want to point out there's this computer here some movie posters and you so so I've got bolt cutters to get into a shed some ammunition a VHS tape and a gun. Yep. From the times I've played this game, played this game, I've like never had the killer whose name is Nicholas Burr. Like I've never seen him come outside and chase me. And so here's the car, a big ass car. 
gas up the car. Yep. Did he kill the boogeyman? Yeah. Now let's get out of here. <laughs> Be careful when you escape. Okay. Also, yes, it is a short game because it's one of his earliest. Like I said, Lieutenant Breaker. Thanks, you quick thinking. The kid is okay, and you're still alive. But, Jack, I'm sorry about your boyfriend, if, which is supposed to be Lieutenant Breaker saying that, not Sarah. The guy who arrested you is named Nicholas Burr. He escaped from Lincoln State Sanitarium earlier tonight, which, fun fact, I've heard that sanitarium's a real place. I don't mean to alarm you, but... What? What is it? By the time officers arrived, his buddy was gone. But I killed him! He was dead! Yeah, I, sh I shot him six times. I assure you we're doing all we can. This is an ongoing investigation. In the meantime, we're going to have to... S I'm going to have somebody take you to a hospital. You'll be safe there. Even though I didn't get hit by him once. Maybe sort of bloodbath. Yeah, so the average, if you, when you know what you're doing, the average playthrough takes about 15 minutes. Also, just before starting this live stream, I was considering whether I should play this or Ratatouille again, because I, when I previously did a live stream of that, like, the camera wasn't, like, done correctly. So now that I've fixed it, I'm considering whether I should do that again. So, yeah, I may play Power Drill Massacre in this live stream as well, which that game is considered to be one of, if not the scariest games of all time. Okay, so, okay, so I'll exit this game and read just the, t read just everything and all that. Hold on, let me just f fix this stream. There we go.
So now I've played that. Let's play one of the scariest games of all time. Also, when you say, also, uh, when you say that that's trippy, is that, are you referring to when I was readjusting the, the screen? So this demo is an old, isn't it? the old demo that you can get on his itch.io page. He did release a, an updated one, but but since this is the more, more accessible one, I'll play this one. So new game. Also, there is there is a glitch in this game where on this this VHS effect, which makes it look like it's a VHS tape. I'll, I'll no when we get about. into the game, I'll turn it off so it doesn't glitch out, potentially. It's from <laughs> also, since this game is so scary, it, it, so like if I get scared and you see, and you see me like from headphones off, I'm sorry. <laughs> Megan, Jeff, are you okay? Ugh, I can't feel my legs. Don't worry, Jeff. I'll go get help. Have fun, Captain. Got to get my be back in a little while. Okay, if if okay if if you are if you if you will be back in a while, then see you then. But if you don't, then it was nice seeing you on this live stream. This is the worst headache ever. I think I'm all right. Skate duck. Better get the flashlight out of the trunk. My flashlight. Pick it up. Yes. So, hey Jeff. Huh. I'm not sure if he's making it. And um, so this game controls are are intentionally made outdated because the way you walk is that f so W or the forward button makes you walk forward in any direction example I'm pressing W right now and she's f the forward so pressing forward makes the character walk in any way she's facing called tank controls That looks like a building in distance. Maybe I can use the phone. Yeah, this takes place back in the... Back, this takes... Takes place in... Takes place in 1987. The, so, which is the same year as the Bite of 87. Sorry, I should have said better. In the same era as the Bite of 87! So, yeah, there was no mobile phones back then, so you had to 
if you had a car accident like like in the middle of nowhere, you had to walk to find a building that had a phone. What a creep old shit. It's boarded up. Oh, nice. Looks like some kids drew a pentagram back here. Oh yeah, because every kid in the world knows how to draw a pentagram. What it is. Pressing F1 changes to this cinematic view, which was used back in the era of games like the original Resident Evil or Silent Hill. So when we get up to the um, actual plot building we're going to, I'll play this view so you can see what it would be be like. But I I won't play it as much when we get into the building. Because playing the game, the game with this cinematic view in the building would get us ki would get me killed, like a hundred percent. Also, if you this is a since this is a, de uh, is a demo, there will be a full release, but I don't know when. So if you want to play this demo for yourself, it's on his um, Puppet Combos Itch.io page. And also with the previous game, if you saw see the beginning, it was called Pig Farmer Games, which is still Puppet Combo, but that was his old name. So we've got a car. It's just a junk car. Nothing interesting inside. It's another shed. It looks exactly like the last one. Door sealed shut. Also, there's a glitch in this game where if you press the F flashlight repeatedly, you can walk through certain walls in this game, which I won't do. Actually, now that we're at the building. Let's go back to the normal view. Also, this game right now is just a scavenger hunt to find free keys to unlock an exit door. So. Um, Okay, but the, um, oh, okay, um, okay, hold on, guys, be right back.
I'm back. Also, let me just rename this live stream to its official title. So let's see. And power drill. Um, got to use a, a, another word that bit that YouTube would be okay with. Sinks are caked with grime. A greasy old toilet. I don't want to play this game. It's like, guys, like, this game is one of the scariest games of all time. game well if you decide to play this game because running alerts the killer to your location so when you run it alerts the driller killer to your location but you so you don't want to run but so you end up walking but the game's so silent when when the killer if the killer finds you, then it's so scary you just want to quit the game. But when you're running, it alerts him to location, but makes the jump scares slightly less scary. Looks like an article ripped out of a newspaper. Read it. Yeah, okay. The search continues for two missing campers in the Pocono Mountains. Mason C. Sergeant and Laurie Summers of Long Island, New York have been missing since June 8th. Their campsite and belongings have been located, but investigators have few leads. Please say there are no visible signs of a struggle and that this continues to be a rescue mission. The rest is missing. It's dated August 1982, five years ago. The same year as the Binary 7. I do not want to play this, but I'm doing it for you guys at home. It's a big drill. Guess this is a factory. A rusted slop sink. 
the building does this building doesn't have running water also don't go near those doors as that's where the killer can come out of and I'll also try and stay silent because if you're if you listen carefully you can hear his footsteps before he gets you The newspaper article. Read it. Pacano vanishings. No trace of missing campers. April 4th, 1985. Since 1978, 12 campers have disappeared over a 100 mile stretch of, of the Pacono Mountains. We conduct dozens of rescue mission, missions each year, says Park Ranger Charlie Plank. People will come up here to camp at high all time without any experience. Accidents happen. While most rescues are successful, these 12 have stumped park rangers and local police. Campsites left burning, boots and jackets left behind, radio still playing. It's like these people were ripped away from their campsites. It says Abe Bradley, who was involved in the search for... I can't read anymore, the ink has faded. A filthy refrigerator, it's empty. Another door, avoid that. Smiley face. I'm out in here. I heard the noise. The, I heard the noise of a jump scare and, and it just ran. So just so you guys can see, I'll turn off on the flashlight. over there. Looks like a key pick up. Got a key of blue and splattered on it. A bathtub for some reason and another key. Looks like a key pick it up. Got a key of crap and splattered on it. There's a note tucked into the corner, read it. My name is David Ashford. My address is 3656 Copen Hollow Road, Deer Creek, Massachusetts. I think I'm going to die here. I'm reading this and hope somebody will, will, will uncover it and know the truth about what happened to us. Somebody came to our campsite in the middle of the night and doesn't seem like this note was finished. 
Looks like a key. Pick it up. Key of rings. I don't think I've ever had it where all three keys have been in this downstairs area because they usually there's usually two down here and one upstairs or two upstairs and one down here. Guess I'll go back upstairs. Lock there, three lock splotters, paint blue, green, red. Use the key, use the key, use the key. Gonna lock it. Let me just let me just check what the live stream looks like with the flashlight. This looks dark. Because right here is the um exit. And I, and I say exit because this it's it's a demo and there's not really much of a story. That is until the full game gets released. Like so I'll go in and then, and then, uh, and then after this I'll go back to the. So after this I'll go back and look for the um, driller killer, so you can guys can see what it's like. Hey, little girl. Get back here. Oh, so I've heard there's a glitch in this in this left in this chasing where if you walk backwards, you just you get closer to the girl. Just a bit of a glitch. Also, you can't interact with the girl or anything.
Actually, yeah, sh sh stream's gone on a bit for long enough. So, so anyway, guys, uh, so thank you for for watching this stream, and. And, um, yeah, so, just, yeah, so just thank you for, for watching this stream. I just, I just, I just wanted to, like, put something out. And, um, so thought I'd do this live stream. So, thank, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video or live stream, whichever I decide to do. See ya.